Wandering Wolf and Aurora. We're uh, actually just about to build a fire at our uh, camp well, off the uh, road right here, off the, off the camp trail. Just to cook. You know, we're not making a camp here. We just want to cook real fast and uh, get up the get up to where we need to go to get on the train. You know, it is. This is the beginning part of the fire. It knows she uses the um, TV. TP um, technique, which is an excellent fire starting technique. It's the same thing everyone uses, I'm pretty sure. So I learned this in Boy Scouts too, so. Well, Cub Scouts <laughs> didn't quite make it to the boys. That would be a different story for another day. So, what we're about to do, we're about to. Um, Wet, cook some of this good stuff right here called creamy chicken soup mix and it looks good because I'm very hungry uh, this is a kick down for Teresa so shout out Teresa for helping us with this food you know that's excellent it was a little wet but we're, we're, we're fighting it. That's going to happen. getting bigger? Not really. Alright, fire's going, it's getting bigger and we're going to probably just let this burn down until we get the hot coals to cook. Hobo style. And uh, really, really uh, stoked about this because Man, it's been, a while. it's been a few days since I had a hot meal. I've been eating granola bars and sandwiches. And taco, well, I did eat one Taco Bell. But we're almost there. Where are we going? Uh, we're in an undisclosed location somewhere in Tennessee. But we're headed out of state soon. Really should have like a rail plate, but we're not on the we're not near the rails right now. We're a four miles hike for where we need to go. A rail plate's kind of heavy to be carrying my pack, but I might try to grab an extra one and carry my pack. Be a good grill though, a real good grills. Take forever to burn us. Hopefully, the uh, pan's helping it trap heat, and we'll have some boiled water here in a minute for our delicious, creamy chicken soup. Provided by Teresa. So shout out Teresa on my video for um, helping us with this excellent camping food. She knows how to pack the train food. She found some the the um, 
you know, the uh, beef stew we had in the uh, last video was provided by Teresa also. She knows how to find the good stuff to cook with. She has everything she needs. In her, like like Sue Street says, she has everything she needs in her house. The only thing she needs is a train. Because she's been... She's been hoboing it for years without even realizing it. <laughs> Just being her. So shout out to Teresa. Much love to Teresa. I want to show it to her. She's going to like Start, start to get the particles moving. Them atoms are getting hot. It's starting to boil. Excellent. I'm pretty stoked about this. <laughs> really? I just put about halfway water. Put about, 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 about two thirds in there. About, 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 say half. Put half. We, we're kind of hungry. It's, it's hey, be it's thicker. Gotta, no, it's got shells in here. It's gotta be cooked. Oh. Wow. I thought it was gonna be like mashed potato soup or no, something. No. Yeah, so we on YouTube. Thank you. You know we. Uh, I didn't know you were recording. How before. can you ask a YouTuber, or you're recording? <laughs> <laughs> you're on the reality show, or the Fabulous Life of the Hobo Kobe, aka Freight Hopping with Kobe Blackman. You're, you're a reality star. <laughs> Huh? I'm putting that uh, that campfire smell back into my clothes. Yeah, I can't believe they have um, a cologne now for campfire and camping. Make you smell like a real hobo. <laughs> they actually do. Have, I, I read the article. Did you smell it? No. Nah. They do put like smoke in a bottle. Yeah. <laughs> they have liquid smoke already in it. You can make your ribs taste like they've been smoked when they was really been in a yeah. fake fire. Uh, liquid smoke. But we're doing it for real. There ain't nothing fake about this. We're actually putting the logs in and different little techniques. The wood was wet. I mean, it rained last night, so we had to dry this wood out. Some of this was kind of sheltered, so it didn't get all the way wet. But we'll bring it back when we eat this good stuff. Well, we pulled it off, and uh, it turned out to be some excellent um, soup. Face uh, it. Really really turned out really well it's a lot of seasoning it's pretty good turned out excellent